A zonohedron is a convex polyhedron with point symmetry, every face of which is a polygon with point symmetry. Any zonohedron may equivalently be described as the Minkowski sum of a set of line segments in three-dimensional space, or as the three-dimensional projection of a hypercube. Zonohedra were originally defined and studied by E. S. Fedorov, a Russian crystallographer. More generally, in any dimension, the Minkowski sum of line segments forms a polytope known as a zonotope. <laughs> Zonohedra that tile space The original motivation for studying zonohedra is that the Voronoi diagram of any lattice forms a convex uniform honeycomb in which the cells are zonohedra. Any zonohedron formed in this way can tessellate three-dimensional space and is called a primary parallelohedron. Each primary parallelohedron is combinatorially equivalent to one of five types, the rhombohedron, including the cube, hexagonal prism, truncated octahedron, rhombic dodecahedron, and the rhombo-hexagonal dodecahedron. <laughs> Zonohedra from Minkowski sums Let V0, V1 be a collection of three-dimensional vectors. With each vector V we may associate a line segment she V, 0 she 1. The Minkowski sum sigma she v, 0 she 1, forms a zonohedron, and all zonohedra that contain the origin have this form. The vectors from which the zonohedron is formed are called its generators. This characterization allows the definition of zonohedra to be generalized to higher dimensions, giving zonotopes. Each edge in a zonohedron is parallel to at least one of the generators, and has length equal to the sum of the lengths of the generators to which it is parallel. Therefore, by choosing a set of generators with no parallel pairs of vectors, and by setting all vector lengths equal, we may form an equilateral version of any combinatorial type of zonohedron. By choosing sets of vectors with high degrees of symmetry, we can form in this way, zonohedra with at least as much symmetry. For instance, generators equally spaced around the equator of a sphere, together with another pair of generators through the poles of the sphere, form zonohedra in the form of prism over regular 2K gons, the cube, hexagonal prism, octagonal prism, decagonal prism, dodecagonal prism, etc. Generators parallel to the edges of an octahedron form a truncated octahedron, and generators parallel to the long diagonals of a cube form a rhombic dodecahedron. The Minkowski sum of any two zonohedra is another zonohedron, generated by the union of the generators of the two given zonohedra. Thus, the Minkowski sum of a cube and a truncated octahedron forms the truncated cuboctahedron, while the Minkowski sum of the cube and the rhombic dodecahedron forms the truncated rhombic dodecahedron. Both of these zonohedra are simple, three faces meet at each vertex, as is the truncated small rhombicuboctahedron formed from the Minkowski sum of the cube, truncated octahedron, and rhombic dodecahedron. <laughs> zonohedra from arrangements The Gauss map of any convex polyhedron maps each face of the polygon to a point on the unit sphere, and maps each edge of the polygon separating a pair of faces to a great circle arc connecting the corresponding two points. 
In the case of a zonohedron, the edges surrounding each face can be grouped into pairs of parallel edges, and when translated via the Gauss map any such pair becomes a pair of contiguous segments on the same great circle. Thus, the edges of the zonohedron can be grouped into zones of parallel edges, which correspond to the segments of a common great circle on the Gauss map, and the one skeleton of the zonohedron can be viewed as the planar dual graph to an arrangement of great circles on the sphere. Conversely any arrangement of great circles may be formed from the Gauss map of a zonohedron generated by vectors perpendicular to the planes through the circles. Any simple zonohedron corresponds in this way to a simplicial arrangement, one in which each face is a triangle. Simplicial arrangements of great circles correspond via central projection to simplicial arrangements of lines in the projective plane, which were studied by Grunbaum 1972. He listed three infinite families of simplicial arrangements, one of which leads to the prisms when converted to zonohedra, and the other two of which correspond to additional infinite families of simple zonohedra. There are also many known examples that do not fit into these three families. Topic. Types of zonohedra Any prism over a regular polygon with an even number of sides forms a zonohedron. These prisms can be formed so that all faces are regular, two opposite faces are equal to the regular polygon from which the prism was formed, and these are connected by a sequence of square faces. Zonohedra of this type are the cube, hexagonal prism, octagonal prism, decagonal prism, dodecagonal prism, etc. In addition to this infinite family of regular faced zonohedra, there are three Archimedean solids, all omnitruncations of the regular forms. The truncated octahedron, with six square and eight hexagonal faces. Omnitruncated tetrahedron. The truncated cuboctahedron, with twelve squares, eight hexagons, and six octagons. Omnitruncated cube. The truncated icosidodecahedron, with 30 squares, 20 hexagons, and 12 decagons. Omnitruncated dodecahedron. In addition, certain Catalan solids, duals of Archimedean solids, are again zonohedra. Kepler's rhombic dodecahedron is the dual of the cuboctahedron. The rhombic triacontahedron is the dual of the icosidodecahedron, others with congruent rhombic faces. Belinsky's rhombic dodecahedron. Rhombic icosahedron. Rhombohedron There are infinitely many zonohedra with rhombic faces that are not all congruent to each other. They include Rhombic aniacatahedron. Topic. Dissection of zonohedra Although it is not generally true that any polyhedron has a dissection into any other polyhedron of the same volume see Hilbert's third problem, it is known that any two zonohedra of equal volumes can be dissected into each other. Topic. Zonohedrification Zonohedrification is a process defined by George W. Hart for creating a zonohedron from another polyhedron. First the vertices of any polyhedron are considered vectors from the polyhedron center. These vectors create the zonohedron which we call the zonohedrification of the original polyhedron. 
For any two vertices of the original polyhedron, there are two opposite planes of the zonohedrification which each have two edges parallel to the vertex vectors. Topic: Zonotopes. The Minkowski sum of line segments in any dimension forms a type of polytope called a zonotope. Equivalently, a zonotope Z display style Z generated by vectors v one. V K element of R N display style V underscore one V underscore K in Math B R carrot N is given by Z equals L one V one plus plus A K V K J A J element of zero one Display style z equals a underscore one v underscore one plus c d o t s plus a underscore k v underscore k for all j a underscore j in zero one. Note that in the special case where k equals n. Display style k equals n. The zonotope Z display style Z is a possibly degenerate parallelotope. The facets of any zonotope are themselves zonotopes of one lower dimension. For instance, the faces of zonohedra are zonogons. Examples of four-dimensional zonotopes include the tesseract, Minkowski sums of d mutually perpendicular equal length line segments, the omnitruncated 5-cell, and the truncated 24-cell. Every permutohedron is a zonotope. <laughs> zonotopes and matroids Fix a zonotope Z display style Z defined from the set of vectors V equals V one V N element of R D Display style V equals V underscore one dots V underscore N in Math B R carrot D and let M Display style M be the D times N Display style D times N Matrix whose columns are the V I display style V underscore I. Then the vector matroid M underscore display style underline math call M on the columns of M display style M encodes a wealth of information about z display style z that is many properties of z display style z 
are purely combinatorial in nature. For example, pairs of opposite facets of Z display style Z are naturally indexed by the co-circuits of M display style math call M and if we consider the oriented matroid M display style math call M represented by M display style M then we obtain a bijection between facets of Z display style Z and signed co-circuits of M display style math call M which extends to a posit anti-isomorphism between the face lattice of Z display style Z and the covectors of M display style math call M ordered by component wise extension of 0 plus minus display style 0 prec plus in particular if M display style M and n display style n are two matrices that differ by a projective transformation then their respective zonotopes are combinatorially equivalent the converse of the previous statement does not hold the segment 0 2 r display style 0 2 subset math b r is a zonotope and is generated by both 2 e 1 display style 2 math b f e underscore 1 and by e 1 e 1 display style math BF e underscore 1 math BF e underscore 1 whose corresponding matrices 2 display style 2 and 1 1 display style 1 to 1 do not differ by a projective transformation. Topic. Tilings Tiling properties of the zonotope Z display style Z are also closely related to the oriented matroid M display style math call M associated to it first we consider the space tiling property the zonotope Z display style Z is said to tile R D display style math B R carrot D if there is a set of vectors lambda r d display style lambda subset math b r caret d such that the union of all translates z plus lambda display style z plus lambda lambda element of lambda display style lambda in lambda is r d 
display style math b r caret d and any two translates intersect in a possibly empty face of each such a zonotope is called a space tiling zonotope. The following classification of space tiling zonotopes is due to McCullen. The zonotope Z display style Z generated by the vectors V display style V tiles space if and only if the corresponding oriented matroid is regular. So the seemingly geometric condition of being a space tiling zonotope actually depends only on the combinatorial structure of the generating vectors. Another family of tilings associated to the zonotope Z display style Z are the zonotopal tilings of Z display style Z a collection of zonotopes as a zonotopal tiling of Z display style Z if it a polyhedral complex with support Z display style Z that is, if the union of all zonotopes in the collection is Z display style Z, and any two intersect in a common, possibly empty face of each. Many of the images of zonohedra on this page can be viewed as zonotopal tilings of a two-dimensional zonotope by simply considering them as planar objects as opposed to planar representations of three-dimensional objects. The bone dress theorem states that there is a bijection between zonotopal tilings of the zonotope Z display style Z and single element lifts of the oriented matroid M display style math call M associated to Z display style Z topic volume Zonohedra, and even more so higher dimensional zonotopes, are noteworthy for admitting a simple analytic formula for their volume. To present the formula, we introduce the notation Z S display style Z S to denote the zonotope Z equals out one V one plus plus A K V K J A J element of zero one Display style z equals a underscore one v underscore one plus c d o t s plus a underscore k v underscore k for all j a underscore j in zero one generated by a set of vectors s equals v one V K element of R N display style s equals v underscore one dots v underscore k in math b r caret n. Then the n-dimensional volume of Z S display style Z s is given by T s 
T equals N debt Z T Display style sum underscore T subset S T equals N debt Z T the determinant in this formula makes sense because as noted above when the set t display style t has cardinality equal to the dimension n display style n of the ambient space the zonotope is a parallelotope Note that when kn display style k, this formula simply states that the zonotope has n volume zero, 